Hey folks, Bill here with Wordy Bird Video. I'm here today, we're gonna to do a review on the uh, Horizon Hobby P51 Mustang with the AS3X technology. I got this off of Brian here at Coyote Hobbies out of Lexington. Uh, how long have you had the hobby shop in Lexington there, Brian? It's, it's been in town for about 13 years and I've owned it for two. What kind of stuff you got in there? We specialize basically in anything remote control, airplanes, cars, boats, um, parts, services, all that. And uh, we're having a good time. Yeah. Glad to be out here with you today. Yeah, it's a great shop. Go out and see him. Can't meet a nicer guy. Knows a lot about the hobby, so go up and see him. I mean, if you're like me, I like to go in and hang out at the hobby shop. So raise your hand if you guys are the guys that like to hang out at the hobby shop. So all you guys on YouTube just raise your hands. We couldn't see you. Uh, but at any rate, uh, check him out if you're in Lexington. Uh, what were you located up there? We're in the Eastland Shopping Center right off of Winchester Road, roughly a mile and a half from I-75. All right, sweet. And thanks for the P-51. No problem. Thank you. Okay, we're going to get her out of the box here. This is a standard Ultra Micro that they've been coming out with for a while. This is the P-51. So I have the old P-51, which is about five or six years old. Uh, so I wanted to replace it. Again, this has got the AS3 technology built in. Uh, we're flying off the grass today, so I'm actually going to pull these little landing gear off so I don't break them. Uh, you just got to pull up the little lip there and they slide right out. So I don't have fingernails very good. But it should come out pretty easy. That way you don't break them. And then of course, if you're on blacktop or smooth surface, you can put those in and the thing taxis really good, or at least the old one does. I'm sure this one does pretty good. I've already bound it, so you guys have seen me do the binding, so I didn't rebind this one. And it's the same way as the little Spitfire that you guys, if you've seen that one. So the AS3X is definitely pretty good. Got a little bit of a breeze today and it seems to be flying really well. It seems to have just as much power as the old one did. Maybe a little bit more. It definitely looks cool. It's going fast, set, and steel. Thanks for watching. Give me a big thumbs up, rate, and subscribe, and thanks a lot. See ya. I'm going to say the Ultra Micros are going up, folks. We got a P51, we got the Spitfire, we got the P40. Got a little racing. And hopefully these guys ain't going to cut me in half because they like to hit me. Where are we racing at? What's the rule? Who's going to go Kill everyone. Around? Don't hit me. <laughs> yeah, but how far are you going to go? Just get outside the runway. Inside the runway like you there that? Yeah. According to Bill, I'm supposed to take the hit. Rick, your problem is you don't have the DX-18. That's what's causing us to go fast. That's what it is. That's what it is. <laughs> ah, here we go! I'm gonna... Oh.